Highwire security practice is made up of about 30 team members who are constantly following the news across time zones. We have offices in Chicago, Boston, New York, and San Francisco. Our team is passionate about the security industry. We work with our clients to craft custom storylines, build relationships with reporters, focus on creative campaigns, and rapid response cycles. Top trends that reporters were covering this year were election security, shocking, I know, and uh, trends related to disinformation in the enterprise. For several key themes that were touched upon during the keynotes, one being the human element of security, and it's very evident because human behavior dictates so many of our security practices. The other things that were really interesting to hear was DevSecOps is maturing. There's a convergence of physical and IT worlds that are changing the way we think about security. And then um, policy, policy is the next frontier. That was something that was pretty evident in a lot of the discussions that we heard during the keynote sessions this year. One of the biggest trends I've seen this year is election security. I think a lot of people are talking about it, especially since we're in 2020 now. One of the biggest trends we're seeing in cybersecurity and coming out of RSA is the focus on the human element, which is actually the theme of this year's RSA. Uh, working with many of our clients, we see that it's not smart to just look at the machine level, but instead you really need to focus um, on human behaviors and taking actions to understand and know what your employees or those in your organization or outside will be doing before um, you leave yourself open to vulnerability. So this is actually my second year attending RSA. I attended first as an intern at Highwire, so it's very nice to come full circle and experience this having done it once before. And some trends that I'm seeing, at least on the show floor compared to last year, is I've been seeing a younger demographic um, and more diverse people all around. So I think that just shows that more people and younger people are being exposed to the world of security and being interested in it and being curious and that's always amazing to see. A big theme that we are seeing in terms of media this year at RSA is a lot more paid media versus earned, especially when it comes to digital content. People are bringing in camera crews, doing man on the street videos, and so digital is definitely on the rise. But some of the top trends I've been noticing a lot of the, the keynote talks I've been focusing on is how 2019 was the year of ransomware. Um, also the rise of nation state attacks. Not only were they super prevalent in 2019, but a lot of keynote speakers are expecting there to be a rise in nation state attacks, namely from Iran, Russia, China. Um, so that's definitely something to keep an eye on in the next year. I would say one of the biggest things that we're seeing this year that we haven't seen in past years or something that's ramping up is just the abundance of paid media for security trades um, versus earned. There's a lot of those trades, you know, dark reading, security ledger, security week, who are starting to do more paid opportunities in order to get um, our spokespeople in front of them versus earned um, as in past years. So tips, uh, given this is my first RSA, is to scope out the best swag on day one so you are not learning on day two that there is a booth giving out mugs with your own selfie on them. At my first RSA, I would say my biggest tips are wear comfortable shoes and bring a portable charger. So excited to share that Highwire has won the Info Security Product Guide PR Team of the Year Award for the second year in a row. Check out our blog and social for more.